Hey, welcome back to my What You Need to Know If You're Thinking About Buying a Home series. This is video three, and I am JR St. Julian with the St. Julian Real Estate Group of EXP Realty. And this is what you need to know if you're thinking about buying a home. If you didn't watch my last two videos, I recommend you go check them out. Just a quick recap on what we talked about prior to this video. Uh, essentially, we built the team. We talked about the importance of finding an agent that you can trust, that can guide you through the process, that's educated, that's professional, and also the importance of finding a loan officer that kind of meets the same criteria and is able to give you all of the financial information so that you have all of your financial questions answered and you know exactly what your budget is. So video one and two, we talked about those things. So now we have worked all of that out. We have established a team. And again, it's very important to recognize that your real estate agent and your lender is your team to home ownership success. So it's very important that you like who's on your team. You feel comfortable with the people that's on your team. And now as a team, we have the information that we need. We're gonna go back to the drawing board in our initial agent client consultation meeting. We talked about our wants, desires, needs, locations, etc. Now we have the budgetary information to solidify what's desires, needs, locations can be, because everything has a price point limit. Now we start going out and look at those homes together. And one thing I'd like you to note that, hey, this is again part of that team building experience because the agent's job is to sit back and observe how you emotionally respond to a home when you walk into it and you really like it versus one when you walk into it and it's not so attractive or it's something that you don't like. Watch what you say about neighborhoods and the feedback that you provide and take all of that information and just make sure that, hey, I'm still in sync and showing them the best potential homes that fit their criteria. Because in my experience, I have found that criteria changes over time once we get out and we start looking at stuff. When we have our initial consult meeting, very often a buyer will say, I want A, B, and C. Those are my primary options. I like D and I really don't care about E. Then we go starting to look at homes and they quickly realize A and B is very important. They don't care about C. D is extremely important and they really like E. So those things change and that's okay because that's part of the process. And if you're working with someone that's observing that, that's listening, that's gathering that feedback from you and processing that information, that person will make the home purchase journey a bit more efficient and help you find that correct home, that dream home a little bit faster and hopefully for a better price. Because if you find it sooner, as this market always does, things tend to appreciate. If you find it sooner, it's gonna cost you less money than if you find it later. So it's important to get to that as soon as possible after you making that decision that you wanna move forward and you know where you are with respect to your budget and what is possible. So that's the big point that I wanna make in this video is that the next step is obviously to start going to see homes. But it's not just about seeing the homes. It's about your agent observing how you respond and making the necessary adjustments and changes to get you into the right homes to help you find that dream home more quickly, more efficiently. So that's video three in my series, What You Need to Know. Hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, if you haven't watched one or two, go check it out. But again, my name is JR St. Julian with the St. Julian Real Estate Group of VXP Realty. And this is what you need to know if you're thinking about buying a home.